Hello and good afternoon, students and staff members. My name is Anthony Sarkis and I'm a grade 11 student. You may remember me as your grade 9 rep, Minister of Internal Affairs, or Minister of External Affairs. For my final year at St. Joseph's, I wish to be your Student Council Deputy Prime Minister. I'll make this as quick as possible because I do not want to take up too much of your time. Why should you vote for me for Deputy Prime Minister? I can't tell you, but allow me to show you. Over the course of the next year, I wish to bring our school spirit back through the roof and make our next year here as enjoyable as possible. Over the last three years of being on SAC, I've learned so much from my duties and I cannot wait to give it back to my fellow members and student body to carry on. We've been through a lot and for that we all deserve a pat on the back. Things got very confusing and overwhelming. From assignments, to due dates, to in-person learning, to online learning, to cohorts. Even this speech was due at 11.59. What I mean to say is, things will get confusing at times, but they do get better. As your DPM, I will provide a safe and encouraging environment while sharing details with the student body, keeping you all in the loop. We shouldn't feel as if we're divided. We're all puzzle pieces fit together, and I want to be the glue that holds us tight. After all, high school is all about making connections, and that's exactly what I strive to continue doing. I've had my fair share of public mistakes throughout my time here, and learning from them is exactly what shaped me into being the person that I am today. As your DPM, I will encourage you all to grow and educate yourselves as I continue to do so myself. We all deserve a chance to be heard, and we all deserve a chance to share our talents with others. As your DPM, I will make it as easy as possible to communicate with. As your DPM, I will keep us all connected and loved by one another. And as your DPM, I will stay in touch with my Prime Minister and teacher moderators to provide the best experiences possible, keeping us close. Vote for someone who you want and not your friends. Vote for someone who you truly believe stood out to you. And vote for someone who won't make all the decisions for you. Vote Anthony Sarkis as your 2022 to 2023 Student Council Deputy Prime Minister. Hey there, lasers. My name is Anthony. Wait, 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 not that Anthony. I'm Anthony Huang, but I'm also running for Deputy Prime Minister. Over the past few months, things have been looking up for everyone. The excitement was through the roof when we had our first pep rally and mass in almost two years. And I look forward to making these next few years here at St. Joe's even better. As you know, a DPM needs leadership, good social skills, adequate communication, responsibility, and leadership. These are all skills that I've been able to develop and work on over the past few years as first a great representative and now a Minister of Internal Affairs. But my time on Student Council has had its fair share of rocky moments, times where things didn't necessarily go according to plan. But being adaptable and versatile allowed for me to face and surpass these obstacles. And I believe that my strengths here are of course transferable to the role of DPM. My plans for this role include making sure that the Prime Minister has adequate resources in order to best support students. And I'll be accomplishing this by being proactive with the organization of school events and by helping the student body as a whole. With two years of experience on SAC and heading into my third year, I will strive for nothing less than 110% during my time as your DPM. You only have one vote, Lasers. Make it count. Hey Lasers, my name is Eva Mahupo and I'm running to be your next Deputy Prime Minister. As grade representative and spiritual liaison, I've had the honor of serving on Student Council. With these positions, I've learned leadership skills as well as how to work hard for our student body. I've been involved on a daily basis, preparing and reciting prayer, organizing events, and bringing other students' perspectives and concerns to Student Council. This past year, I've learned from leaders and teachers in Student Parliament, as well as other extracurriculars such as Diaspora Club, Debate, Track and Field, and Laser News. As Deputy Prime Minister, I pledge to go above and beyond to make next year unforgettable. There is nothing I will not do to help. I promise to be fair and just while representing everyone, regardless of race, gender, or sexuality. You will hear from other incredible candidates today, but I'm here to tell you that I am the best candidate for this job. I take pride in knowing that no matter what situations arise next year, I will work tirelessly alongside with the Prime Minister and other elected Student Council officials to ensure that they are resolved in the way that meets the needs of the entire student body. As someone you see every morning, I promise to be there with you every step of the way next year. I could go on and on why I'd make an excellent Deputy Prime Minister, but the bottom line is that I, Eva Mahupo, am the best candidate for this job, and I will do everything in my power to be the person you need especially during this period of recovery and restoration as we prepare for our full normal school year back. Thank you and don't forget to vote Eva Mahupo for Deputy Prime Minister. Amen.
inclusive, and unforgettable. That's how I wish our next year to look like here at St. Joe's. Hi Lasers, my name is Gabriella Babic, and I'm running not only for myself, but for you guys as well to be Deputy Prime Minister together. You might be wondering, how is that possible? Well, voting for me means voting for a leader that will represent and listen to you, the student body. I care about our school and your opinions and will put forth my greatest effort to represent everyone's wishes at such a high level. After serving on SAC for two full years, I've gained the experience and knowledge to give back to our school and lead us through a fantastic year. And just remember, a vote for me is a vote for ye. <laughs> vote for Gabby for DPM. Thank you. Hey lasers, it's me, Larsa, on the screen again. Anyone else sick of having to watch people speak through a screen? I mean, you're even gonna have to watch this beautiful speech through a screen. And no, I'm not here to give you guys a speech on how COVID has made a huge impact on our lives, because I'm sure you already know that. But what I am here to tell you is that with me, Larsa, as your prime minister, there will be no more dwelling in the past. Grade 11s, next year, your final year of high school is going to be so jam-packed with fun that you're going to forget you even missed the first three. As for the 9s and 10s, next year is not only going to be so fun, but it'll also leave an impact and set the bar for the rest of your high school experience. Now, you're probably wondering, Larsa, how are you, a single person, going to make this happen? Well, I'm actually not working alone. I'll let you guys in on a little secret. A vote for me is a vote for you. That's right. I want to represent all 1,400 of you. So if you guys have an idea for a dress down day or a school dance, or if you want no school on Fridays, well, okay, I actually can't promise any of that, but I can promise to fully advocate for any ideas you guys give me at our weekly student council meetings. You can relay any ideas to me by stopping me in the hallway, because trust me, I'm not that eager to get to class, or by texting me on Instagram, Snapchat, or even shooting me an email if like, that's your thing. Anyway, I know you guys are probably super bored. So if you guys wanna hear a more detailed explanation of my campaign, follow me on Instagram at B-O-T-E-L-A-R-S-A. -S that's Boat Larsa on Instagram. There you'll find more school spirit ideas, social movement ideas, and even a little bit more about me. So if you want a fun, engaging, and inclusive school year, make sure to vote me, Larsa, as your prime minister. Hey Lasers, my name is Diane Cruz. In this moment, you may be asking yourselves, why would I vote for you? Why choose Diane Cruz to represent the St. Joseph student body as your Prime Minister? Through my experience as a Grade 9 representative, Student Council Secretary, and a Minister of Communications, I've gained three years of experience that will guarantee you a Prime Minister who knows what they're doing. I've integrated myself into the school community through school apparel designs, the announcements, social media, and so much more. The most important thing to me is your school spirit, ensuring a high school experience that will make up for the lost time during COVID. I will dedicate myself to representing and communicating the ideas, concerns, and opinions that any of you may have. I am ready to hear you out and be your voice in making our school community a better place. I'd like to make it very clear that this is not a token position for me. This is something that I've been working towards since grade nine, and I can guarantee to all of you that I will take this position seriously and take my best efforts into making the most of the 2022-2023 school year. My name is Diane Cruz, and I can assure you that a vote for me is a vote you won't regret. Thank you.